for tuning into Adventures with Single Sister Travel. I am Martina. I am your host of the channel. I am in Ocean. Hey, first of all, first things first. If you're new to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe down below and click the notification bell next to it so that you are notified when I upload the next video. I'm trying to fix my camera here. I never know which way to look. Look that way, look this way. Okay. So yes, go ahead and do that. Um, like I said, I am in Oceanside, California. Oceanside is a part of San Diego County. It is in the northern portion of uh, San Diego County. It sits in between uh, San Diego and Los Angeles. The Metrolink does run through uh, the city, so you can take Metrolink into San Diego or you can take Metrolink into Los Angeles. And if you know the California highways, you know that it is mad, clustered, crazy. The 5, the 91, the 60, the 10, all of them are crazy. So please save yourself a headache and <clears throat> get on the Metrolink and go ahead and tour around. So I'm going to share with you, um, I'm going to do a tour. I am staying at the Wyndham uh, Timeshare here in Oceanside. And if you are a timeshare owner, then you can exchange in through RCI or II, Interval, Interval International. So I'll show you some of the um, areas that's close around within walking. I mean, we can go straight through the parking lot. You come up on the other end, and there's Joe's Crab Shack. There's the, uh, the marina there with the boats. You can go out whale watching. There are restaurants there. There is the beach at the end of the um, marina. That's open to the public. So that's all within walking distance. And there's Denny's, I think, right here that you can go and have breakfast. Okay. Ten minutes or so down by car. Oh, Okay, guys, so let's go in and take a tour of this unit. Nice, nice, very nice. It is a one bedroom, a nice queen size bed, flat screen TV, no view at all, absolutely no view, but that's okay. Don't plan on spending a lot of time here inside the room anyway. Nice size bathroom. This, however, is a handicap unit. It was the only thing available, so I took it because the sun is out. We're having beautiful weather this weekend, and I wanted to be here on the beach. So, don't mind the little stool and the grab bars. They provide you with absolutely everything that you can think of. Everything that you have at home, they have already stocked here in the unit extra towels beach towels pillows uh cleaning supplies stackable washer and dryer with complimentary detergent not the best detergent but hey it's complimentary nice open unit with a little island everything is fairly low like i said this is a handicap unit but you have your microwave, electric stove, knives. You have your toaster and blender. And a coffee maker with some complimentary. Let me see what is in here. Mm, coffee, regular and decaf. You have tea, sugar, creamer. Yeah. Okay, we have some mixing bowls here. That's probably a blender over here somewhere. Or did I see that on the other side? Some more bowls. Uh, we have wine glasses, water glasses, some plastic tumblers. And what's in here? Okay. Plates, bowls, and coffee cups. Like I said, everything that you would need here behind this, these decorative doors is a Murphy bed. So if you have guests, maybe you come with the children, this pulls out to a nice uh, full-size bed. And that is a, a regular mattress on there, guys. 
very comfortable. So there's your unit, nice and open, dining room table, sofa and chair. The sofa does not let out into a bed. In fact, it reminds me more of office furniture, something you see in your doctor's office, so small. A nice fireplace and another flat screen TV. I'm going to enjoy this fireplace this evening. MB MP3 player and a large patio equipped with the electric grill and table and chairs. So again, this is the unit. It is a one bedroom, sleeps four, very comfortable, fully equipped. So let's go tour around, see what else there is to offer. So that is the, the tunnel passageway leading into the marina. This is a public parking area between the resort and the marina. You know, they bring the trucks here, the boats and RVs. The resort do have uh, underground parking for the guests. The Metrolink is right over here. That's a, the Metrolink train track right above going into San Diego or Los Angeles. The passageway is very uh, safe. It's well lit. Cars are able to come from the opposite direction. They are aware of the pedestrians, so it is not dangerous at all. No one's going to run you over. But right when you come out, there is Joe's Crab Shack. There's discounts offered um, from the resort. I think tonight I have a coupon for a free appetizer. Um, happy hour, I think, is like from 4 to 7 or something like that. And the marina also have uh, restaurants. There's the lighthouse, ocean bar and grill. There's a fish and chip and a couple of, a piece of pizza, an Italian restaurant. You can also, let me see, you can rent boats, go whale watching. There's paddle boats and some other things. But as we walk down uh, the marina, we'll see what else they have to offer. But this here is the Oceanside Marina, and at the end of the walkway is the public beach. We will go down there and uh, tour the beach and see what's happening. Look for whale watching. They have sort of an idea. So well watching, fishing, and here are some more views of the marina. Just looking back, taking a look back. Hey little guy. He says you don't have any food, he's ignoring me. So I'm not quite sure. It looks as if you can rent paddle boats, but then I can't really see it. Look like boat club. Should have zoomed in a little bit more, but yes, they're renting. Look like those um, kayaks and paddle boards. Look at that marina, isn't that beautiful? And this is the lighthouse. I don't have the sun in my eye, so yes, that is the lighthouse. Some little shopping, pick up some knickknacks here and there. Look at all these boats, so peaceful. Okay, so right up here, let's see what they have. What can we do here? All right, so there's your two-hour whale watching and dolphin tour. Hey, you see that Harbor Wine Cruise, $39 a person? That's not bad. What? Okay, but here is the beach. And if you can see over there in the distance... 
that is the Oceanside Pier. So like I said, not even a 10-minute um, ride down. And at the very end of that pier is Ruby's Restaurant. And back at the resort, and like I said, you have to be staying here at the resort and have a key to get back in. Or otherwise you have to walk all the way around to the front. And we are back. So I am now going to go in and relax. And like I said, stay tuned for some more tours of Oceanside.